What is the Basset Hound's bite force? When it comes to discussing a dog breed's bite force, the Basset Hound might not be the first breed that comes to mind. Known for their droopy eyes and long, floppy ears, these hounds are more commonly associated with their friendly and laid-back nature rather than their jaw strength. However, every dog has a bite force, and it's fascinating to explore and compare these figures among various breeds. In this article, we will delve into the question, what is the Basset Hound's bite force? To understand a dog's bite force, it is essential to examine the factors that contribute to it. One significant element is the dog's anatomy, specifically its jaw structure. The shape of a dog's head, the length and alignment of its teeth, the power of its jaw muscles, and even the size of the dog itself can all affect its bite force. These factors, along with the dog's temperament and training, determine how much pressure it can exert with its bite. When it comes to the Basset Hound, their structure and physical characteristics play a role in determining their bite force. These dogs have a large head with a strong jaw, enabling them to chew and bite effectively. Their teeth are sharp and well aligned, designed for gripping and tearing apart their prey. While their overall size may not be as imposing as that of some other breeds, Basset Hounds are known for having a firm grip once they latch onto something. However, despite their anatomical suitability for biting, Basset Hounds are not known for having an exceptional bite force. Their bite force is estimated to be around 100 to 180 pounds per square inch psi. To put this into perspective, larger and more powerful breeds like the German Shepherd or the Rottweiler have a bite force of around 238 to 328 psi. The Basset Hound's bite force falls within the range of other medium-sized breeds such as the Labrador Retriever or the Boxer. It's important to note that bite force measurements can vary depending on the studies conducted and the methods used to obtain the data. Therefore, the figures provided are estimates based on the available information. Additionally, it is worth mentioning that bite force should not be the sole factor in determining a dog's aggression or danger level. Many other aspects, such as temperament, training, and upbringing, are crucial in determining a dog's behavior and potential risk. So, why would someone be interested in knowing the bite force of a Basset Hound? While this information may not be of utmost importance for most dog owners, it can still be useful for professionals working in fields such as veterinary medicine or dog training. Understanding the varying bite forces among different breeds allows them to assess potential risks and adapt their practices accordingly. In conclusion, the Basset Hound may not be renowned for its bite force, but it still possesses a substantial ability to exert pressure with its jaws. With an estimated bite force of around 100 to 180 psi, these lovable hounds fall within the range of other medium-sized breeds. Nonetheless, it is essential to remember that a dog's bite force is only one aspect of their behavior and should not be the sole determinant of their personality or potential danger. A dog's temperament, training, and upbringing play significant roles in shaping their behavior and should always be taken into consideration.